In 1995, in a small town off a lonely highway, there was a theater. And as your eyes adjust to the dark, you realize it's actually more seats attached upside down to the ceiling, arranged just like the seats on the floor. But the theater was hiding a dark secret. I decided in my final days to find out if this really is an elevator to hell. Time to Die presents the true story of some unsuspecting moviegoers. I don't like work here or nothing. There was just nobody back here, so like I came back to get some popcorn and stuff. Oh, a large bag for myself if you don't mind, chap. Who found themselves locked inside their worst nightmare. Suddenly you feel a jolt and your stomach gets a familiar soft pang like you feel when you're descending in an elevator and it feels as though the entire theater is going down. On October 25th... When Julie inevitably throws up in the next six seconds, which way does it go? (laughs) Some evil is going down. Oh, this is quite strange, so you can't hand me anything. That's because we're dead, mister. Brace yourselves for one hell of a ride inside the elevator. Are you ages? You could. You hate old people? No, Brian <laughs> is saying that we need to have a genocide of everybody above 65. And no, I wait. need everybody that listens to this podcast to know that Brian thinks that. For more information and where to listen, visit timetodierpg.com. Time to die.